hello guys in today's video we're going to learn how to install pycharm on our windows machine first of all let's search pycharm on our on our google search pycharm so you're going to select by um, jet brains i'll put the link in the description below so you're going to click download And on that download, you can see that we have Windows, MacBook. So if you're installing Windows, it will be on Windows. Then if you're installing MacBook, you it will you you select MacBook, DMG. And if you're installing Linux, you click on Linux. So you're you're going to be installing it on our Windows machine. So let's click on Windows. So um we have pycharm professional which is um the paid version but for this video we're going to be we're going to scroll down and we're going to install the pycharm community version so you're going to click on download so it's downloading so we'll wait for a few seconds so now our installation is complete so now let's go out to our download folder and click on so now it's asking do you want to allow this app to make changes on your device click on yes so click next so this is the destination where the PyCharm Community Edition will be saved. So if you want to change it, you can click here. But for this video, I'll keep it in the default description. So I'll click next. So look at the space required. It will require 1.7 gigabyte. So I'll click next. So in the installation option, we are going to take um, the PyCharm Community Edition, the desktop, it will create shortcuts for us to update our context menu. So we'll, we'll take this one. So it will, add, it will open folder as project for us and for we to associate it as Python. So we are going to select PY. And this one is one of the most important one. This one will update our path variable to re restart when needed. So we are going to add this one to, and we're going to click next. And we're going to click install. So it will take a um, few minutes to install it for us. So um, you can see already that it has created a shortcut for us. So it's going to take a few minutes. So we have to wait for a few minutes. So our installation is almost complete. So it's telling us to reboot our system. So I'm going to reboot it now and click finish. Okay, let me select. I'm going to select reboot it manually and I'll click finish. So for we to open our PyCharm and write our first code, let's double click on, Py, on the PyCharm Community Edition. So now we'll change our project name. We'll call it um, Data Project. This is the location where our project is going to be saved. So it said project will be created. So you're going to create a welcome script. We'll tick on this one. And we'll use project vent. So we we'll use and we'll click um, create. So it's creating our virtual environment for us. So this is our um this is our sample script so if we click run so it's saying hi pycharm so, 
you can see the print of and the name so in this parameter you can write whatever you want so here um, um, is the name print by charm so if i change it to to kingsley it will write hi kingsley so let's click run so you can see it wrote hi kingsley so basically this is how you install pycharm on your windows machine thank you for watching and kindly subscribe if you haven't subscribed keep learning